there is a stunning place in india called saurashtra saura rashtra in sanskrit saura means the sun and rashtra means country think about the sun heat the desert sand shade hot winds beautiful clothes amazing food spices bright colors pure cotton clothes kala kapas centuries of tradition and an ongoing living legacy of the same it's 1983 and sayed haider raza paints this masterpiece he's in a studio far away in france and boy is he missing home how would you paint this scene conceptually realistically use impressionism surrealism maybe metaphorically or would you use abstraction a love letter to his motherland that he was trying to perfect for so many years and now he finally did it it's 1983 all of us have an important milestone in our lives and i believe that this painting was for raza this painting was sold at the christies auction on the 10th of june 2010 for a whopping amount of 16.3 crore rupees that's over 2 million us dollars at the time raza was 88 making him one of india's priciest modern artists look at these colors burnt primal yellows and reds raw sienna burnt amber sage buff scarlet india red sap greens saffron leaf green paints gray gold crimson vermilion olive green emerald green flake white chrome yellow lemon yellow the colossal work expresses the emotive quality of colors and sensations of the landscape of the peninsular region of western india also known as you guessed it saurashtra these colors are juxtaposed along with the bright light yellow on the edges illuminating the work with the heat of india his native land i strongly feel that he is taking us along with him on a journey of india from the south to north from the east to the west portraying the amalgamation of the diverse cultures that represents his cradle what do you think just look at the application of paint vigorous use of brush strokes with geometric abstraction what a paradox he returned to his roots he creates his own language of both abstraction as well as indian philosophy all this is happening without the suggestion of actual objects at the same time the emerging and recessive depths of the painting are totally contained by the flickering framework of red and green suggesting indian manuscript illustrations a charming sense of color aided by a vigorous and facile mode of expression he has almost perfected the manner in which he wanted to portray his beloved land to be filled with respect for the indian philosophy culture and age old traditions there is a reason raza chose this language of abstraction and that's because it's universal yes saurashtra is a place a real place but then again this is a love letter to his motherland we'd like to thank the raza foundation for this video please like comment and subscribe to art history plus for more videos like this thank you